I, Ronald Leposum Sengi, having been appointed a member of the National Police Service Commission under the National Police Service Commission Act 2011, do solemnly swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the public, that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my knowledge and the ability, discharge the trust. I, Esther Chui Kalombini, having been appointed as a member of the National Police Service Commission, under the National Police Service Commission Act 2011, do swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I'll faithfully and fully, impartially and to the best of my knowledge and ability, discharge the trust, perform the functions, and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, or prejudice. I, Murshid Abdallah Muhammad, having been appointed a member of the National Police Service Commission under the National Police Service Commission Act 2011, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faith faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my knowledge and ability, discharge the trust, perform the functions, and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, or prejudice. So help me God. I, Major Moyo Shadwagamutia, having been appointed a member of the National Police Service Commission, under the National Police Service Commission Act 2011, do solemnly swear, declare, and affirm that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my knowledge and ability, discharge the trust, perform the functions, and exercise <coughs> the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, <coughs> or prejudice. So help me God. I, Mary Auma Uwur, having been appointed a member of the National Police Service Commission under the National Police Service Act of 2011, do solemnly swear that I will at all times obey, respect, and uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully, impartially, and to the best of my knowledge and ability, discharge the trust perform the functions and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear, favor, bias, affection, or prejudice. So help me God. I, Johnston Kavoludi, having been appointed the chairperson of the National Police Service Commission under the National Police Service Commission Act 2011, do solemnly affirm that I will at all times obey, respect, uphold the Constitution of Kenya and all other laws of the Republic, that I will faithfully and fully, fully, impartially, and to the best of my knowledge and ability, discharge the trust, perform the functions, and exercise the powers devolving upon me by virtue of this appointment without fear favor, bias, affection, or prejudice. So help me God.
Mr. Chairman, your commissioners, I want to join uh, the minister in congratulating you on your appointment to this very, very important commission. I also want to assure you of the support of the state law office. I'm sure at an appropriate time we will meet there and uh, discuss matters of mutual interest. You have 100% uh, of our support. Thirdly, I would like to encourage you. I don't think it will be a very easy job because the expectation of the Kenyan people are very, very high about reforming this particular sector. But reading through your CVs and uh, looking at some of you who I know for a long time, I'm sure the country would not be in better hands. And I know you will do a very good job. <laughs> ili tuone kwamba uh, kabla ya kufik, kufikia wakati wa December tutakuwa tuko na inspector generali hatutaki tuharakishe zaidi kwa sababu tukifanya hivyo huenda tukafanya makosa na ile ni ofisi ambayo iko na maana zaidi tungependa kuchukua nafasi yetu tuteue mtu ambaye anastahili sio tu kwamba mtu ambaye ataketi pale Hiyo ndiyo sababu tunaona kwamba tupatiwe muda tumepewa ofisi leo tu kwa hivyo tutaketi chini tujita, tujaribu kabisa alafu tutawaelezea kila wakati ambapo tunafikia kiwango fulani tutakuwa tukieleza uh, ni wapi tupo